uh, and with this i think our plan is uh, to come to the closing uh, session once again uh, where i have asked actually my colleague uh, alex lemon uh, to step in and being one of the main authors of uh, the report uh, that the, the draft report that we prepared uh, 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 and to basically share his uh, interpretation and his uh, observations from uh, these last two days uh, uh, in uh, uh, in the discussions that we had in the meeting. Alex, please share okay. with us. Yeah, you know. thank you, Nelly, and uh, I'll be quick. Uh, just to be clear, uh, Angela uh, Bulaga will speak uh, subsequently. She... Sorry, we didn't. Uh, we didn't inform. Unfortunately, we got a message just before we started. All right. That Angela. <laughs> right. Okay. Um, Angela is not available. She got sick seriously, uh, and she's not with us. Okay. Today, Good. Uh, so. Uh, I stand between you and your respective lunch breaks or breakfast, wherever you are. Um, I'll be brief and just thank everyone uh, for their participation, uh, the collaborators, the uh, co-authors of the report and, and uh, protagonists in this project uh, learned a great deal from these two days of discussions. It was a really rich um, discussion coming from the different perspectives that you, um, that you have. Um, let me uh, just uh, throw up three three main points that stand out for me. Um, one is um, the the challenge in this specific region is is immense. Uh, it is a a key um, you know carbon intensive uh, region where the transition in the energy sector in particular is in the very very early stages. Um, our estimates over 100 billion to be done by uh, 2030 is just one benchmark. Um, and of course, now that uh, agenda is, uh, is doubly urgent given um, the, the, the massive reconstruction uh, needs and investment requirements that are hopefully coming up as soon as a, a stable macro and security framework is, is identified in Ukraine. Um, so um, that combined with the uh, with the uh, transformation in international debt markets, which which John Kidney uh, you know set out so so eloquently, so powerfully, um, I think uh, gives the backdrop for a very powerful uh, dynamic. Uh, so there is a structural transformation in uh, international bond markets. Um, the uh, issuer base, uh, the mandates of asset owners demand. Uh, ESG alignment um, that is uh, substantial already uh, as accounting for the European debt markets and, and uh, even though the, the, the cross-border flows of climate finance, uh, of private climate finance are uh, somewhat limited, uh, this will come to all emerging and, and frontier markets in equal measure. Yeah? Um, so uh, there are a, a widening uh, investor base, uh, there's a widening set of, of instruments. I think the uh, potential of, of sustainability linked bonds came up in, in uh, a number of contributions. Um, but there's equally also a, a greater scrutiny uh, of, of the standards and quality of, of impact uh, monitoring and, and uh, transparency by the issuer. And, and I think that's that's a, a valuable uh, message that came up, uh, not just from the uh, colleagues from 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 the IFIs, uh, that any issues will need to bear those those higher and and so sort of tightening standards in in mind. Now, um, so we've heard a lot about uh, you know other potential uh, experiences that are encouraging, uh, not just in, in other emerging markets, ASEAN in particular, but also within the region in, in Hungary and the Baltics. Um, the framework uh, needs to be holistic. It cannot just be uh, the, uh, the, the, the green bond uh, framework. Uh, it it, it uh, feeds on the quality of the projects that are generated in particular by the green, uh, by the, uh, green loan portfolio of individual banks um, who, who then in turn can be uh, issuers in their own right. And I think the, the uh, experience from Armenia and other banks who have issued uh, is, is really encouraging. Yeah? 
Um, so uh, to I mean one one message that came out for me quite quite strongly is that uh, a lot happens um, even though uh, the, the local markets are still uh, woefully underdeveloped. Um, uh, I think ASEAN is a region where we now see local markets uh, becoming liquid also in green bonds, uh, but uh, these, these bond market development programs have been going on for nearly 20 years or so. Um, this region here in Eastern Europe is, is well behind, and I think now the investor risk aversion that we're observing uh, is an additional challenge. Um, but I think the, today, certainly, the, the efforts by, by IFC, EU, and EBRD to work with individual issuers to really ingrain um, the, the green um, governance um, is, is, is really key. And, and that, to my mind, is a very strong benefit that came out in our discussions. Um, and uh, that has a benefit well beyond any potential uh, funding uh, benefits in terms of, of uh, debt service costs. Um, and I think that's uh, an ingrained uh, quality of corporate governance to um, track to generate green taxonomy aligned projects and track uh, proceeds, um, uh, which the green bonds will, will uh, bring about. Um, so this is um, I think a, a good good uh, set of discussions which we will uh, you know now condense in a revised report. We look forward to your comments to the draft we circulated, um, and then I, I think uh, the other message is there needs to be capacity building and knowledge sharing, uh, and I hope this uh, report funded by the EU and and managed by OECD and uh, the collaborators who have um, helped produce it uh, will play uh, its, its own part in that. And um, with this, uh, I hope um, this greater integration and, and common shared agenda around uh, the low carbon transition um, can also be, be furthered uh, with uh, the, the green bond instrument. Okay. Um, so, in a nutshell, that was my my uh, two cents worth, and uh, let me hand it back to Nelly. Thank you very much, Alex. I think it's a very good, uh, concise, and I think uh, uh, summary of uh, what we've uh, discussed. Indeed, it was a very, very rich discussion, I think, over the last uh, two days, and we, we will have a lot to uh, think about and uh, reflect in the new version of uh, our report. Uh, but maybe in this context, I just uh, want to say that uh, I hope everybody received the report, and those who are interested uh, to provide the uh, uh, the feedback on the report. Uh, we are looking for your uh, comments by the end of the month. So please think about, uh, uh, you know, uh, sending uh, your uh, your uh, comments to us. I want to uh, recognize that uh, uh, our colleague from Kazakhstan, Aigu, already did that, and it's uh, super helpful. So we already start, uh, uh, we will start uh, doing this uh, work uh, very, very soon. I think, uh, on my side, I want to thank everybody uh, who was with us today, uh, and uh, I have been particularly closely working on uh, with uh, on organizing and uh, preparing uh, the agenda. Uh, and uh, maybe at this stage, I want to ask uh, Krzysztof also to uh, cover to to say a few words uh, uh, to uh, you know tell us how he felt about these two days of. Uh, uh, discussions and uh, maybe uh, what we can do next. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Nelly. Um, the fact that we still have uh, quite a number of participants uh, uh, being with us, uh, even the agenda time is over already as, as planned. So that's already a, a very important indication of a, of a fascinating discussion that we've had uh, over the last uh, two days. And, and from, from my perspective, the, I think we really uncovered uh, a lot of issues. We've been going through the, a bit of a despair to the enthusiasm and back and forth. This is, we managed, I think, to move into the more of the positive and, 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 and constructive uh, path, which is very encouraging. I think this is something that I very much like to do is to build on good examples. So even those are small, but I think it's very, 
very important to, that we found out this progress and now we can move move on and, and, and build on it. Uh, the one thing I, 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 I took away from it is that the green bonds, I'm getting with the green bonds, it is difficult topic, it is difficult technically, conceptually, but once you get through you know, certain first steps, you're actually much better off. That's a, that's a very important message that we should use in our, in our further work. So thank you very much, uh, all the speakers who have been uh, sharing the views and, and, and experience. Uh, thanks, for you, thanks for everyone to use, to use, to sharing the also information and very active participation in the chat and, um, and providing us with information and questions. We'll be following up, collecting more information and sharing with the participants. Uh, I would like to thank Alex and his team for the all the work that that has, has gone to prepare the, the draft report. We will be now finalizing using also the input from the discussion. Uh, we will be looking for your comments by the end of this month, by the 30th of June. Please uh, send this to Nelly uh, and, and Alexander will be using your comments in the finalization of the report, which will be also uh, enriched by country uh, chapters. So the report that you've seen is a regional character, and then we'll have also uh, a more specific uh, country uh, descriptions. And finally, I would like to thank Nelly uh, for uh, preparing an excellent list of uh, uh, outstanding speakers uh, leading the discussion. Uh, and Jonathan, who has been behind this, the screens and behind the, the consulate of our uh, of our meeting. Um, I would like also to uh, thank our uh, donors, the European Commission, who provided us with funding through the EU for Environment program, and also Germany through the International Climate Initiative. We uh, appreciate this very much, and, and then we will be working on on uh, delivering the, the products. Uh, finally, as usual, I would like to thank Natalia for excellent work with the interpretation as usual. So you will hear from us. We will work on making the recording uh, available to the, to the participants and further information will be available from, our, from the website of the meeting. So Nelly, I think now we can Close the Call meeting the and wish and 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 wish everyone good rest of the day, good weekend, and uh, yeah, hope for for better days to come. Uh, building on some positive experience we've learned about. And I just want to say that we will definitely stay in touch. And I think uh, I hope we will continue working together because there is a lot of work to be done, and there is a lot of work for everybody involved in this. Uh, in this business so and we need to stay together and to work together so i believe uh, we will have uh, many more opportunities uh, to to work uh, uh, in the future and uh, i hope that with the next time we do this we meet face to face and not uh, online and because i think it will be much better and uh, much more fun uh, thank you very much once again and enjoy uh, the, the weekend and we'll definitely stay in touch thank you thank you very much thank bye you bye. very much bye, -bye. bye.